Manchester United are considering a shock transfer for Ivan Tony, according to reports. The Red Devils are in the market for a new forward in the summer to compete with Rasmus Hodgland. And, according to transfer expert Fabrizio Romano, their search may land them on Brentford ace Tony. Tony has made no secret of his desire to leave the bees for pastures new in the summer. Man United are yet to finalize their summer transfer strategy following the investment of Sir Jim Ratcliffe and Ineos, who have been handed control over the club's football operations after a decade of mediocrity under the Glazers. Ratcliffe and his new team are still ironing out certain profiles they want, and are deciding between bringing an experienced or younger frontman. Read more on Man UTD CAR putt I bought Rashford's Rolls Royce for £185,000, but was left stunned at damage Hot Wheels win a Porsche 992 GT3 rupees or £275,000 cash alternative from 89p with our discount but, according to Romano in his daily briefing column for Court Offside, Tony's availability could prompt Man United to make a move. Romano said, it's just one of the options to be considered and discussed internally. Man United are still in early stages of the process to decide which striker they want to sign, experienced or young. Talks are gonna take place internally. Tony will be one of the names available on the market so it could be one to watch. Most read in football terror threat Euro 2024 terror warning to England fans after dangers rise to new level no hard fillings Moyes gives brutally blunt forward assessment of Calvin Phillips substars Hell England goalkeeper Ellie Roebuck reveals she suffered a stroke gore blimey Gordon gets red card and MOTM at the same time in never before seen moment casino special, best casino welcome offers at the age of 28, Tony would offer a wealth of experience without age being a risk. Arsenal and Chelsea are among the other clubs who have been linked with the star. Inside Ivan Tony's life as a footballer however, Sun Sport understands the Gunners have called their interest, leaving the Blues, Tottenham and West Ham as the main parties in the running to have expressed interest. That is of course, Barring a move from Man United to bring Tony to Old Trafford. Tony unlikely to let opportunity slide by Charlie Wyatt Ivan Tony will be backing himself to beat Ollie Watkins in the race to Euro 2024. Because when it comes to supreme self-confidence, others might call it extraordinary arrogance, Tony gives Zlatan Ibrahimovic, football's ultimate big head, a run for his money. If, heaven forbid, something did happen to Harry Kane ahead of the summer tournament in Germany, Brentford striker Tony would likely see himself the only viable alternative as a replacement number 9. Equally, if England found themselves in another shootout at this year's final in Berlin on July 14, most would want the bloke who has scored 35 of his 38 career penalties to be one of Gareth Southgate's takers. Aston Villa forward Watkins, 28, is enjoying the best season of his career with 22 goals in all competitions but his Euros trial did not go so well with a disappointing performance in the 1-0 defeat by Brazil on Saturday.
Against Belgium, Tony is unlikely to make the same mistake. A strong performance could see the Brentford ace continue on his journey from footballing outcast to, potentially, a national hero this summer. Given Eric Ten Hag likes to utilise a physically dominant forward such as Sebastian Haller at Ajax or Woot Weghorst at Man United last season, it stands to reason that Tony would complement the Dutchman's system. In the meantime, Tony is set to start for England in their friendly against Belgium. Tony returned to football in January following a betting ban. In that time he has netted four goals in ten Premier League games, but blanked in each of his last five.